Right, let's get to Manchester United. And a certain Cristiano Ronaldo has been criticising Eric Ten Hag. He's actually questioned his mentality. Yeah, Ronaldo, who had two spells at United, says United need to rebuild everything. Mm, yeah, strong quotes here from Ronaldo. Yeah, who said that the coach says that they cannot compete to win the league and the Champions League. As Manchester United coach, you cannot say that you're not going to fight to win the league or Champions League. Mentally, you can say maybe we don't have that potential, but I cannot say that. We're going to try. You have to try. What I wish for Manchester United, it's what I wish for me to be the best team they can. I love that club. I'm not that kind of guy that forgot the past. They need to rebuild everything, in my opinion. Part of the criticism of Ten Hag will be this, what, what he has said basically is what you would say in year one, not in year three. Um, but I guess his argument would be, Actually, this is year one because it's the first year since the Jim Ratcliffe came in and since, obviously, the, the kind of restructuring of the club has happened. So he's looking at it and saying, well, the past two years, I've had to deal with this situation where the club was badly organised, I didn't have the support I needed. When Ten Hag initially made the decision to get rid of Ronaldo and he did that round of interviews then famously, or infamously maybe, uh, there, was more, there was a lot more sympathy for Ten Hag's position. I did think he handled it well. In the time since, maybe you'd say even the time since the League Cup that shortly followed that, t there's obviously been this huge debate about Ten Hag himself. And, and this kind of almost touches on a bit of a culture war. Well, Mark, there you go. Uh, comments from Cristiano Ronaldo. Explain why they are uh, significant now. Well, he's one of the most iconic sportsmen on the planet. 638 million Instagram followers. And, of course, a Manchester United legend. 346 appearances, 145 goals, 64 assists. And he won pretty much everything whilst he was at Old Trafford in two separate spells. Three Premier League titles, um, the Champions League, Club World Cup, and played under Sir Alex Ferguson. So, any time he speaks about Manchester United, it's going to carry weight. Mm. Um, so, therefore, it's quite significant, these comments. We know that there wasn't the best relationship at the end of his time when he left Manchester United, having played under Eric Ten Hag. But once again, this will be a little bit of a thorn in the side uh, for Eric Ten Hag. While he's already under pressure after a disappointing start to the season, Manchester United last won the Premier League title under Sir Alex Ferguson back in 2013. Mm, yeah, yes. going to be interesting, isn't it?